Well, some people who have had weight loss surgery say it's not a quick fix. They say it's a surgery that changes your life forever. CNN assignment editor Travis Saddy White joins me now, and it's been about four years, Travis, since your surgery, right? Yeah, it'll be four um, years in February. Good to have you. I'm Thanks. curious, what has the life change been for you? How much weight did you lose, and how long has it been? Well, when I had weight loss surgery, I weighed 397 pounds. Uh, I am now down to about 250 pounds. Have about 50 pounds to go until I hit my goal. Um, and it's been a very interesting journey. Um, I'm at the part now where I have to take it on my own by watching what I eat and working out and, and kind of carrying the torch the rest of the way. After the initial surgery, the initial which was surgery. Um, gastric sleeve surgery. What's right. the difference between gastric sleeve and gastric bypass? Well, I won't, I'll skip all the gory details, <laughs> but it's, it's less invasive, I would say. Um, it, it has to do with a lot of internal stuff, mm -hmm. and it, al it, al it keeps, it allows your body to absorb the necessary nutrients and stuff that you wouldn't be able to do, or your body would be, um, it would be difficult for your body to do when you have uh, gastric bypass. Why would you say that was the right decision for you? Well, at the time, um, I w had type 2 diabetes, I had high blood pressure, and I suffered from sleep apnea. Mm. And those were things that were corrected fairly quickly after my surgery. I haven't had any insulin since three days after my surgery, which, is, which will be four years in February. Um, I still check my blood sugar numbers and stuff like that just to make sure all is well. Uh, my blood pressure's come down. There's no sleep apnea. So there, there are a lot of things that have, that have corrected, corrected itself as a result of the surgery. What would you say is the biggest difference in life before the surgery and life after? It's a mind thing. For, it's mm -hmm. been a mind thing for me. It is because at 397 pounds, I sort of accepted this is what my life is going to be like at 397 pounds, even though I worked out somewhat and tried to watch what I eat uh, or what I ate. But um, now, as the weight starts to come off, I'm having to deal with the whole new self-esteem, the new me. And, you know, being able to go to the mall and buy clothes off the rack instead of going to the big and tall store. Or, you know, just those little small things that those mind things that you have to overcome when once you lose. Do you feel like people treat you differently? I've noticed that there have been some people who treated me differently. I've cut some friends loose or mm, people I thought were friends. Um, and I've gotten attention from people that didn't necessarily want to give me attention when I weighed 397 mm. pounds. Um, and that's their loss. Mm -hmm. That's how I look at it. Um, and so I, I think People have always said I've had a great personality, and so some people say your personality has, has grown tremendously um, since that. Uh, but, you know, overall, if I had to do it all over again, without a doubt, I would do it all over again. That's great, and an inspiration to a lot of people. Travis Saddy-White, thanks for being with Absolutely. us and sharing your story. Absolutely, thanks for having story. me.